And with that, we thank you for joining us here at 5. I'm Fred Shropshire. And I'm Vanessa Rufus. First tonight, folks living in a South Charlotte neighborhood are concerned about their safety, saying property crimes are becoming more brazen. The Rock Creek Apartments seeing several car break-ins with things like guns and ammo being stolen and pictured here. WCNC Charlotte's Jane Monreal showing us why people living there are frustrated with property management. Police usually advise people to lock your car before you leave it, especially at night. But here at this complex in Ballantyne, the thieves are breaking into windows to get into cars. CMPD posting on social media the arrests of three suspects Thursday morning after a recent string of car break-ins. Twelve cars got broken into the other night. Gabe Jones had one of those cars in the parking lot of Rock Creek at Ballantyne Commons. He ended up with two broken windows and a glove compartment now sitting on the floorboard. It stinks, but, you know, I'm fortunate they didn't take anything. I mean, I didn't have any weapons in my car. Uh, I did have a small pocket knife they took. Jones says this is not the only time where neighbors' cars have been broken into. I know the first time around they said it was four suspects. Public safety aside, some people living here say they're also frustrated with the apartment's property management. You should have been informed, whether it was weeks ago, last week, whatever it was. You should have taken it upon yourself as a community, as an apartment complex to tell us this is happening in our community. Shannon Windham says there are no security cameras and no guard patrolling the grounds. You want to tell me we're in a luxury living apartment and my car is being broken into or people's cars are being broken into on a consistent basis and you're not doing anything to notify nor protect us. I checked in with the office on site. She referred me to Night Vest, their corporate office out of Dallas, Texas. I reached out but have yet to hear back. The company's home page says, quote, Night Vest Residential puts residents first in everything we do, unquote. But some tenants like Tondra Windham say they are seriously considering moving out. The 30 some cars in one subdivision being broken into and nobody is saying anything like that's insane. It's if crazy. It's, if they said, you know, putting cameras in or guarding the right would cost, we'd have to run that cost to you guys. No, 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 no. They raised the rent here for every residence this past year. Oh, the economy. Oh, we got to make remodel, I mean, remodeling and, and fix up the, the, but you don't do anything to protect the residents. That's a problem. With residents saying that thieves are targeting weapons, they advise to go ahead and leave weapons at home. In Ballantyne, Jane Monreal, WCNC Charlotte.